Hi, Danny Ventura of the Boston Herald. We're here with Corbin Miles, star swimmer at Acton Boxborough. You didn't waste much time to make your uh, varsity splash, so to speak. You set a meet record right off the bat. Talk about your freshman performance at the States. Uh, well, coming in as a freshman, I didn't know what to expect. I, I never swam at a championship high, uh, high school meet, so I just kind of went in and just tried as hard as I could, and I got good results, and I was really proud of it. Well, I mean, I think you're underestimating yourself. Good results. You set a meet record. When you hear you set a meet record, were you surprised? I was pretty surprised, yeah, because I didn't, first off, I didn't know what the record was. I wasn't thinking I was close to it. I was thinking it was more, more of a state record that, like, how fast the time would be. So I wasn't, it wasn't really in my mind to break that record. I was just trying to, you know, win or get, like, a, a top seed, and I... I ended up getting this, uh, the meet record. Since then, you've been the predominant sprinter in the state in the 50 and 100 holding meet records. What is the key to your success? Uh, well, I know that there's, there's nothing in front of me to uh, reach except for best time. So it's always me against myself and me against my own times. So I really have to work myself in practice to be better than I was the day before and then always work hard on the little things so that I could be better than I was the year before. Your skills are taking you, you're going to Georgia Tech. What was it about Georgia Tech that convinced you this is where you wanted to swim at the next level? Well, it's, it's a great um, tech school. It's one of the best in the country for mechanical and biomedical engineering, which I'm both interested in. And the facilities are great there. The coaches are great. The, the head coach was an Olympian. She, had a, she has a gold medal in one of the relays. Um, all the coaches have years of experience at the uh, Division One level, so I know they'll take care of me when I get there. Great. Thanks so much. Here with Jeff Johnson, the longtime swimming coach here at Acton Boxborough. You've had some good swimmers, as we could see with the state championship. Certainly have a premier one in Corbin Miles. What is it about him that makes him special? Uh, he's just a hard worker. It's one of the best freestyles I've ever seen. He's got a great start. He's a great turn and a great finish on the 50. Um, and that's basically what a 50 is. It, uh, for the times that he's doing, he did a 20.30 last year, and we're hoping he breaks 20 seconds this year. Uh, that's like he was 13th in the country as a junior, so we're hoping for him to be one of the top 50 freestylers in the country. Certainly when he comes in as a freshman, you know you're not getting a normal freshman. What was it that really stood out right away about him? Well, I've, I've known Corbin since he was 10. And when he was 12 years old, he won New England's in the 50 and the 100 freestyle. And uh, I kind of knew what I had. And I was just waiting to see him sprout. And he's, he's won the 50 every year so far as a freshman, sophomore, and junior. And, uh, and he's been pretty good in the 100 freestyle. He won the 100 freestyle last year. And his, his anchors on our relays, it, some of the splits I see, that's, that's what I see out of the college swimmers doing the splits at the end of the, uh, the relays. It's like, it's going to be one of the top swimmers for Georgia Tech for a long time to come.